Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm Savannah and today we have a Sephora haul. Oh my gosh, this is all from two different orders. I may or may not have had some fun ordering through Black Friday and all of that stuff, so oh, I'm so excited. It's been hard not to just dig in and use all of this stuff. I'm going to go in order though, and I wrote down all the prices and everything, so to help you out. Alright, first up, this video is not sponsored in any way, shape, or form, by the way. You know, like usual. <laughs> but please don't forget, like, comment, subscribe. I upload every Tuesday and Friday, 4 p.m. Central Standard Time, and occasionally I'll upload a bonus video on Fridays. Not Fridays, wow, Saturdays, Savannah. <sighs> Alright, can't tell? I'm trying out a new lens on my camera. Really excited about this, really, really. I keep looking at the, like, mirror behind. To, I'm like, wow, it's so different. So, let me know what you think and if you think I should continue doing videos with it. Alright. First up, I'm going to show you this little thing. This is the First Aid Beauty KP Bump Eraser Body Scrub with 10% AHA. With, that is... Yeah, safe for sensitive skin. It was ten dollars, and I bought one for here, and then I got. There's another one in here somewhere. A second for my mom. Just yeah, trying them out. Hopefully it'll help because they, my mom had some bumps on her arm. So does my boyfriend's kiddos and him. Curious to see if that helps them. I heard about it from Jamie Page. So, wanted to try it for them. Next up, girls better not be watching this. <laughs> I got three of these palettes. They were, are normally $10, but they were on sale for $5. It's the Sephora Animal Eyes Palette. Eight shades in it. Which one did I open? This one. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I figured a $5 palette is about the max I'm going to spend for them because kids. But that is the palette. I have not tried it and I'm very, very curious about the quality. The, yeah, I definitely will be doing a video with this soon. Today's eyeshadow, I just kind of played around and used a mixture of like three different color pop palettes. <laughs> Oops. And the last item from the first Sephora order was this. The Living Proof Restore Dry Scalp Treatment. It retails for $32. This is seriously amazing. Honestly, I, I'm obsessed. Yeah. Really plows? <laughs> it snowed a lot this weekend. It's Monday morning right now. Well, no, it's late 1.30 now, I guess. But I still haven't eaten food. Oops. But this has saved my scalp. My scalp gets very dry and flaky and just, ugh. So I have to use clarifying treatments and stuff for my hair. Anywho, this helps bring back some moisture in it. I had such a hard time finding this in stores for a while. I went in store at Sephora and in store at Ulta. And they, the Ulta employee was like, you know, we haven't gotten that in a while. I'm wondering if they are repackaging or something, but managed to get a hold of it online by ordering. So first order done. I'm just gonna pile everything out because there's a lot. There is a lot. You know, samples and point boosters. I didn't just buy everything upon impulse by the way. <laughs> I, I let things sit in my cart for a little bit and thought about it. Alright, so first up, I have two gifts for my boyfriend's sister and his brother's fiance. So, don't look, you two, if you're watching this, Erica and Molly, don't watch the rest of this video, please. Okay, I'm giving you a chance to click off now. 
so I was told not to go all out and crazy like I usually do for them but I wanted to do a little something so I did something small and decided to focus on self-love so I got them each two little masks here so first off I have the Clinique Moisture Surge overnight mask I got two of these little babies and they are eight dollars a piece so a little hydration is good especially since you can sleep with this on your face and then I got them each a Sephora mud mask purifying and mattifying little set here. well thing here it is very thick plastic and heavy those were five dollars each so really hope that they will enjoy those Wanted to give them a little something. What are they doing outside? Hateful. Savannah's trying to film here. All right. Next up, I'm going to move my paper closer here. I have the a Tarte Color Splash Lipstick. And mine is in the shade Salt Life. Beautiful packaging. And a beautiful shade right here. Oh man, I will give you a little swatch here. Right there. That's pretty. I can't wait to use you. And that was a $14.50 purchase. Alright. Boop, boop, bamboo. Boop. I'm very excited about this. I've got a different one of these, but the shade is just a little brown for me. And then another Tarte item. It is the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea H2O Gloss in, you guessed it, Salt Life. And this one was $13.50. I've been using more glosses, so I really wanted to pick this up. Give you a little swatch. I love the cap. It's like got little water droplets on it. There it is. That is a perfect match for that lipstick. Oh, I'm so excited. Why did I put those things back in their packaging? I don't know. All right, next. Oh, I didn't finish all my listing. Oh, man. Um, I will put this, the pricing of this down in the description box for all of you. This is the NARS O-R-G-A-S-M mini lip duo and I'm wearing this on my lips today <laughs> so, there is the lip balm afterglow lip balm and then the lip gloss both in the signature shade there is the beautiful lip balm very tiny and I doubt you're gonna see it on my hand yeah that is very very sheer and glowy but hydrating as can it be so right there pretty though I want to stick with that because just felt like it today then the gloss try to layer that up <laughs> actually I wore them both together so can't really see them, can ya? But they are, they're pretty. I'm excited to play around with them. <gasps> There's so many lip sets that I kept seeing that I really was like, I want you, I want you, I want you, I want, I want it all. But yeah. All right, next up, I've got some pretty vulgar items here. Oh man, I repurchased one of my favorite mascaras for $23. And, you know, I want to try and compare it to the Wander Beauty mascara that I love also. So, okay. See what one is actually my favorite because those two are pretty much tied, I think. But that is the mascara. It's so beautiful. Pretty vulgar, full reels mascara. And Black Swan. Oh, man. I love it. I love it. And I really want to play with you some more and figure out what mascara I actually adore the most. That one is actually cheaper than the Wander Beauty one, I believe, so. Yep, yeah. <laughs> fine.
came with me. Then I got this baby. I've held off opening it. It is the Sealed with a Kiss Powder and Mist, which was $17.50. The setting powder in here is seriously one of my favorite setting powders ever. So, yeah. And it seems like you can't get just the powder anymore. So, you know what? I'm getting it this way. It's actually cheaper right now in the set. Anywho. And if it's going away, I want more of that. So I'll have to use that less on camera. Sadly. At least I'll have it for my personal life. So. Yep. Pretty vulgar. The powder of 147. Matt about it. Translucent setting powder. Seriously, I love this. I have it on right now because I'm always using it. And then I got this little mist. It's so cute. It looks like an antique little perfume bottle. And I want to give you a spray. I haven't tried this, so mascara, please stay on. Okay, come on. Mm, faint scent. Ooh, I like that, mister. It's very nice. Oh. Ooh. I like you. I like you. All right. On to point perks and samples. <laughs> uh, where is everything hiding in front of me? All right. The one point perk I got was the Pharmacy Green Clean Makeup Meltaway Cleansing Balm. I've only tried one cleansing balm in the past, and I was not really a fan, but... You know, I want, I'd like to give you a little bit of a try, especially since I'm not paying for you technically. Just points. So, I've heard a lot of good things about it, but then again, I heard a lot of good things about the other one. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, samples. Did I really not get any with my first order? Huh. Weird. Okay. So I got the Amica Brush Bust Your Brass Cool Blonde Conditioner and Shampoo. Yeah, as if I need more of that kind of thing. And then I got the Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder. So just the standard one here. A little thing to try of it. I've only tried the glow one and oh my gosh, I was not a fan of that. It really darkened up my under eyes and just... A mess. Really? Is that it? Am I missing something? No? Okay. Okay. I'm gonna actually quick put a little bit of this gloss on on top of what I have on right now. Because why not? I'm like, I can't see what I'm doing. I can look in the back of my phone. It's receptive. Little sticky, but not overly sticky. Good. I like you. I'm excited. As always, this is all my preferences. So, yeah. <laughs> As always, don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, ring that bell to see more of my goofy face. And I hope to see you all in my next video. Thank you for watching. And if you have watched all the way to the end, you should do, like a bird emoji for me some sort of a bird emoji and comment what item from this little haul you think is the best so yeah and let me know if you've tried the kp bump eraser from first aid beauty let me know your thoughts on that too and i will see you all in my next video i love you all bye also don't forget to tell me what do you think of the new lens